Pink Poodle Crafts, join the Poodle Pack. It's time to get creative and make you laugh. Make your own art today. Pink Poodle Crafts is the way. What a good boy. Hello, everybody. How's everybody doing? I'm eating a Pop-Tart because... I was sitting doing all the postage for the all the rest of the auction stuff. And I've been doing that for like hours, making sure everything was packed and and everything. And then huh, I forgot to eat. I ate this when I got up, but then I forgot to eat anything else all day. So when I got up and start, oh, it's almost, you know, time for me to get ready for the mixed media mashup. I'm running around getting everything together and I realize, whoo, I'm starting to feel lightheaded because I didn't eat. <laughs> so I grabbed a Pop-Tart and I was like, I'm going to sit and eat Pop-Tart. <laughs> That'll help. You went to the dentist today? Well, let me say hi to everybody. Hi, Miss Bima and Tiffany and Shannon and Sandy and Millie and Shalama. Hello, and Patty Ann and Renee. Hello, hello, and Miss Pauline and Diana and Sandy, which I think I said hi to, and Laura and Barbara and Janie and Martha. Hello. And Cheryl, hello. And Susan, hello. And JD, hello. And Gail, hello. Who am I missing? Mm. Kathleen, hello. And Teresa, hello. And Tina, hello. And Doji, hello, Doji. And Monica, did I say hello, Monica? If not, hello. Hmm. I'm going to be working on a canvas panel and a piece of smaller wa smaller watercolor paper um, today. That's the deal. You don't have to work on a canvas. You can just work on whatever paper you normally work on. Hi, Erin. And Patty Am. And Penny. I'm talking with a mouthful. I'm sorry. All right. Who's the, who's the sneaky one that sent me this? Because I got this in the mail and I was so confused. And for a minute, I thought maybe I ordered it, but I'm like, no, I don't order things from Bed Bath & Beyond. And I'm thinking, well, did I, did I, did I go? Because I, I, and I realized that it took me a minute, but I'm like, no, I've never actually ordered anything from them online. And the only time I've ever gotten anything from Bed Bath & Beyond was when I would go there. My friend would always go during the time that they had like a sale where everything was like, like everything was like 50% off or I don't know, like a lot of things they'd have like a, I don't know if they have it annually or what, but I've gone a couple times with her and gotten a bunch of stuff. And like some of it was like buy three and get like one free. So her and I would kind of split it. But that's the only time I ever bought anything. Not well, that me. But let me tell you something. I've been putting this on all day. It came in the mail today. It is so nice and it smells so good. Mmm, I love it. My God. And there wasn't one in the box, there was two. And it smells like it smells like that smell. Um like it's it's the closest to that Hawaiian tropic smell that I love so much. It's the closest, um, and it's so nice, and I love it because it's got shea butter in it, and it makes my hands all nice and soft. So I've been putting it on all day, and I already notice how nice my hands look compared to how they normally look and feel. And so this stuff's really nice for especially for my hands. It's a body lotion, but and I'll use it. I'll use one. I'm probably going to put have one in here, which I can use as a body lotion when I get out of the shower because my shower is right over there. And then I'll put one in the living room for before I go to bed. I like to put lotion on, but I didn't really have a good lotion out there. So which one of you was the sneaky one? 
Yeah, I, I noticed that Janie said it wasn't her and, and she thinks it's me. I'm like, yeah, so it's probably Janie. <laughs> it's, stop it. But it's probably one of you. But it's I know it's definitely not me. And you know how I realized finally that it was definitely not me? Because it came to Stacey Evans. Now, if I order something online, there's only a few people that know that my actual name is Humphreys. I can get mail to Stacey Evans. That's not an issue. But when I order something, I have to put in my name that's on my credit card, which is Humphreys. So I wouldn't have ordered that. And not just that, it was on the shipping paper that came with it. It said that it was billed to and, or no, it said it was shipped to and ha I think it was, I think it had had my name like twice on it somewhere. Not billed to my name, but it, but it didn't say who it was billed to, but it said it was shipped to and, oh, and on the, on the box, it said my name. And then on the thing, it said shipped to or something. I don't know, but it said it twice or something. Oh, it wasn't you. I don't know who it was. It definitely wasn't me though, because if it was me, my, my name Humphreys would be on it. Because anything I order, my name will appear as Humphreys, not Evans. So, I don't know who the culprit is. Yep, you said it wasn't you earlier, Barbara, so I don't know. I don't know. Some sneaky one. It's one of you sneakies. And, and you, you made sure you didn't, you know, you made sure that it was... That your whoever it was that sent it to me didn't have their name on it anywhere because the even the sheet that it came with doesn't that's what I meant like didn't have their name on it, it had my name on it so I'm like hmm was it you Kathy did you send me lotion from from Bed Bath and Be Bed Bath and Beyond no Bath and Body Works I always get the two confused I need to gesso my page I don't oh, I got lotion on my page <laughs> nice my page will be nice and soft. Uh, Chris should be here later. Uh, he should be here like by 10 o'clock. Um, because he's got to grab the packages that I've put out. And then also, um, he's, excuse you, Jesus, everything just fell. Um, he has to go downstairs. When he gets here, I'll have to, I'll have to step away from the camera for about, five minutes or less because he has to go downstairs. I have a camera in the basement in the garage and it's hooked up to my alarm system and the stupid thing went offline a few days ago and I think it's because my internet was being weird and he has, I, you know, and I don't, I don't go down there and, I, and it needs two people because one person has to stay up here kind of and, and make sure that it, I mean, I could do it, but I'm not going to. But anyway, so I need to have him go down there and put the bu push the button on it and make sure that it's it comes back on. So I need to make sure he does that when he's here. Oh, the hair. Great. So who is playing along with us? And is anybody new besides Barbara? Because she always thinks she's new. <laughs> so who is playing along with us? today and if you're new let me know so that I can kind of explain what's going on if you're you know if you don't know I mean you don't have to you don't have to chat the whole time or anything if you don't like to chat but just to let me know so I I can explain it um, and then you know because I realize there are some people that might want to play, but they don't want to chat. But you don't have to chat the whole time. Just let me know that you're here and that you're new so that I can explain how it works. Teresa's playing. Carrie Ann's playing. Aaron's playing, Bima's playing, Laura's playing. Hi, Laura, by the way. Tiffany, are you playing? Um, Barbara's not playing. Well, I would imagine you're not playing, Barbara, after all the all the crap you had to Did you actually go back to that place, Barbara, today? Did you go did you end up going back to get more? Or did you give up for the day? 
hopefully it wasn't not too far of a drive to go there. Um, let's see. Tina's playing. Cheryl, are you just watching Cheryl? Um, Shannon's playing. Amy's playing. Cheryl, the other Cheryl's playing, JD's playing, Laura's playing, Tiffany's playing, Martha's just watching, Kathleen, and I don't know, I think you said you were playing before. Uh, let's see, who else? Susan says she's playing. Um, you did go back? Oh, cool. Karen's playing, Kathleen's playing. Cool. All right, let me put some gesso on this page as well. I'm going to try to do the, both these pages in completely different colors. And I say try because if the cards come up where it has like a color, then obviously it'll have to go on both pages. But otherwise, any of the colors that I have a choice of, I'm not going to choose the same for each, I will choose different. Hi, Ray. You just watching Renee? Whoa, that was loud. You're shy. Uh-huh. You have to get your nerve up for what? To play this? You've played this before. Shazzy, you're just watching today. Jessie, she says I'm new. <laughs> You're new, all right. so new Barbara and Shazzy how come you have a wrench and, and your name is in blue like you're a moderator huh oh it is it's your first time doji I know you've been here before when we've done it so that's awesome yay I'm glad you're playing along oh you're moving your craft room oh that sounds fun <laughs> I, I know I know all about that. When I had to move this my craft room, it was not fun. Good luck on that, Shalama. <laughs> Where are you moving it to? A different room in the house? A bigger room? Oh, wow. That's crazy, Barbara. <laughs>
can't give wrenches to everyone. That would be silly. <laughs> wrench Nazi. That's right. <laughs> no wrench for you. Quit bitching about being a wrench or not being a wrench. You're going to throw a wrench into the plans of life. <laughs> I know. She's a delicate flower, isn't she? <laughs> Such a delicate flower she is. Um, Did I bring the cards over here? Hello. Where the hell did they go? Oh, maybe I didn't. Maybe I left them on where I put them. Yep, I did. I did. I left them. <laughs> I sat and shuffled the, shuffled up the cards and left them over there. Duh. Not smart. All right. Hi, Karen. Since new people has come in, does anybody know who sent me the, the bottles of Coco Shea from Bed Bath & Beyond? Anybody? All right, Ray, you get to have a wrench because you came to see me. <laughs> All right. No one is going to tell you move past it, Stacy. Huh? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Hi, Marianne. What are you talking about? Move past what? Hi, Carla. Oh, the lotion? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, know. I noticed that. Apparently, nobody's going to tell me. I've had that happen a couple of times and I've, I've learned to, cause the, the first couple of times that happened where somebody sent me something anonymous, I went through hell and back trying to figure out who sent it to me and you know, nobody would let on to who, who it was. So I learned to give up after a while. Yes, I realize what she meant now, but there's a lag. So if I say something, if somebody responds to it, it usually takes like a minute. And by then I'm on to different thoughts. So I don't realize that they're talking about the same thing. Because my brain doesn't work and I can't remember one thing that I say from the other half the time. All right, let's start with the first card. Add paint or ink with a brayer. Where is my brayer? Let me add this to the thing. All right, um, I need a brayer. And that'll work. I need two different colors. Let's see. 
Okay, so we're going to use those colors. I'll use those on that, actually, and I'll use these on this. If you don't have a brayer, just use a credit card to spread it. You know what I mean? You have to make the sound effects or else it doesn't work. There we go. That's good. Yeah, and then I'll send you a brayer. You can you can use a credit card and send me five hundred dollars, and then I'll send you a brayer. I'm just kidding. <laughs> weirdo. You're a weirdo. If you're not subscribed to Miss Bima, you need to go subscribe to her because she did a really cute technique where she did like a faux stained glass and I just got clumps in my paint. Damn it. So go subscribe to Miss Bima because you can see her cute technique. She did like a faux stained glass. This is very liquidy. So go send a subscribey to her. I can tell, Miss Bima, you just started your channel, didn't you, Miss Bima? Did you just start your channel? No, you've had your channel a while. I'm just looking now. About a month. Well, yeah, you, it's new. So you've had it about a month. She's not answering me. Where'd she go? Bima. Hello. Did you hear what I said? Bima. She ain't paying attention to me. Anyway, go subscribe to her if you haven't yet. 
because here's why. I think that her channel is going to end up doing really well. And so go subscribe to her because she does a lot. She has a lot of cute ideas and um, I, I like her videos and stuff. So I think she's going to do really well on YouTube. Yeah, you. I don't know anybody else named Brenda. <laughs> Never mind. Don't subscribe to her because she doesn't pay attention. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Let me try this. Well, you better decide fast, Irina. And I would say that, yes, you should play. Because if you don't play, you might not get to win this canvas when I finish it. So. Because I'm giving away this canvas today to somebody who's been going, working along with us. You have to be working along with us today to win it. Got to be in it to win it. Okay. Is everybody ready for the next one? Yes, go subscribe to Tiffany because she's doing live streams. So go subscribe to Tiffany as well. Miss Tiffany does live streams. Girls, what are you doing? They're out there fighting over a toy. Not really fighting, they're play fighting kind of, but sometimes they get a little rough and it makes me angry. I don't want them being real rough with each other. Well, Carla, I want some chicken pot pie. I'll plug you. I'll give you a plug right up your butt. I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah, Tiffany, you need to get in touch with me so that I can help you get your thing set up for... Uh, I realized what's going on because um, Facebook... No, YouTube is changing the way they do live streams um, for that situation. They're not going to be using, after the end of this year, they're not going to be using the Hangouts, which is, why they've, that, which is why they've done things a little different, which is why I was like, what the hell is going on when I was trying to help you? But I can still walk you through it and show you how to do it. Um, you, were in a, you were in the new way that they are doing things, and I don't know how they're going to set up for having multiple people in your stream that way. But for now, I can show you how to do it the way that I know how to do it. All right, I'm assuming we are ready for the next card. So we will pick it like our nose collage. Collage, collage, collage. That is the next card. So collage, whatever. Some paper, some ephemera, something. That's what you should be doing now. Except I need something to collage with. And I don't know what happened to my box of stuff. Oh, I might need to go get my my massager thing for my back because oh that hurts so the last couple of days i didn't use it that much and uh yep i'm noticing that pain comes back if i don't use that thing i woke up with it i, I was in pain when i woke up and i fell asleep with the stupid the stupid massager thing laying next to me it's like a big hook like a plastic hook and you reach it behind your back and you pull on it while i was doing it i was laying on my side and i was doing it while I was laying down and then I kind of fell asleep with the damn thing wrapped around my shoulder because <laughs> I was so tired. But I woke up in so much pain that I had to kick all the girls off of me and all the dogs off of me. 
I was like, get up, get up, get up, because they were hurting me and I had to stretch. And I can't find my box of collage paper. I really hope I didn't drop it into the pit of the unknown on the other side of this thing over here, because that would really suck. Because that means that I have a bunch of little bits of paper on the floor. Is this the other one? Whoa. Let me see if the other little thing is in here. Yeah, here we go. Alright. I have my can. I have a can and then I have a box as well. Yes, I know I need to use my tools. I'm going to go get it in a minute. So, I'm going to put some... Oh, we can throw that down. Don't want that. We can put that there. Don't want that. She can put... Sandy loves the big ones. Look, I I'm not here to judge what you like, Sandy. <laughs> but she likes it big. I'm just saying. Those are her words. I need some glue. What do I do with my glue? Hmm. I lost it, that's for sure. Is this it? No. What the hell's my glue? Must I lose everything? Here it is. Oh, I don't have very much left. Well, that's part of the job, so she ain't got a choice. Otherwise, I take it away. <laughs> she has to stay awake or else I'll take her wrench away. Ew, pork rinds? Ugh. 
Nope. Don't like those. something I can get into is the pork grind thing. They're just kind of weird. I don't like the texture of them. They're just kind of weird. I tried one once and they were too salty. They were just kind of weird tasting. Not my snack of choice. You know what I do like? Um, what's it called? Um, Cheetos? No, for, uh, Chester Cheetah. Th that that brand, which is, I guess, yeah, Cheetos. Um, they came out with a um, a white cheddar, a white cheddar cheese puff, and man, they're good. I didn't think I was going to like it as much because I like white cheddar popcorn, but I've tried things before that, oh, it's white cheddar this or whatever, and I never liked it really before, but besides the popcorn from, what's the name of that company, Smart Pop, I think it is, they, they're they like the first ones that came out with the with a white cheddar popcorn, and man, I remember that stuff. It was all the rage at the time. People would go nuts for that popcorn. Yeah, the white cheddar uh, Cheetos. Yeah, they're really good. I was impressed. Oh, whatever, I guess it's staying there. That's exactly what it means, Laura. It means they are the boss of you, at least in here. fun to glue down because this piece is not going to want to glue down very well because it's a thicker piece and it's got foiling on the back which even makes it worse sometimes they don't like to stick
Um, is that the pick you put in the secret group? Because I saw it, I saw it very briefly on my phone before my phone died. I didn't realize the battery was dead on my phone. I could have sworn I charged it last night, but I think the plug came undone and it wasn't really charging. And then I didn't notice it today that it wasn't charged and then it died. I was like, well, that's nice. But yes, I was, I saw that right before my phone started to yell at me and then shut off. This piece down here. Yes, yeah, she's very cute. <laughs> very cute. down fool stick down So is anybody else working on a canvas or am I the only one? Good night, Shalama. Good luck with your room. Don't work too hard. Where did I put the glue? There it is. I couldn't see where I had stuck it down. I hope you have help to move your room. I had help when I moved mine. Miss Kelly was nice enough to help me. Thank goodness. Literally, it was like, I think the day after I got out of the hospital, I was like, I'm moving my room.
on, sucker. Stick down. Hi, Sherry. And don't forget I'm having an auction on Sunday at 4 o'clock. Um, actually, I'll put the link in so that Nightbot is doing it. And if you share the link on Facebook and make sure you tag me because if you don't tag me um, I'll enter the people that shared it into uh, a drawing and if you share it once a day shush if you share it once a day between now and Sunday on Facebook and tag me each time, I'll I'll put you in for more prizes. Like you'll get more than one entry. Your name will be in more than once. So don't forget to do that. But you have to tag me because if you don't tag me, your name will not be in the thing because I can't there's no way for me to know if you shared it unless you tag me. Oh, thanks, Janie. That's the link there. And then I'm also going to put it in the, uh, so that Nightbot has it as well. So that it's there. But thank you, Miss Janie. See, you have to remember to tag me. If you just start, if you if you do it this way and just start typing my name to say Stacy is having an auction, as soon as you start typing my name, if the tag should pop up, so you won't you won't have to remember. If you just remember to say Stacy is having an auction, that'll automatically bring up my tag. You know, bring up the thing to tag me. So then you can't forget. Trying to put it in there, but it's not Nightbot's being a pain in my ass. Let's see. Um,
Okay. Alrighty. I put it in there so Nightbot should put the link in as well. Hi, Debbie. You chilling with the cat and your hubby? But does your hubby purr and rub up against you like the cat does and show you affection? <laughs> Which one's better? <laughs> Which one's better to cuddle with? He tries. <laughs> well, I'm sure his tongue is softer than a cat's tongue, that's for sure. Because Kissing somebody with a cat tongue would not be fun. Imagine how painful that would be. had deja vu <laughs> what that you were doing mixed media mashup all right is everybody ready for the next one all your cat does is lick your cheek <laughs> Winnie tries to make out with me she tilts her head and comes in for a kiss right on my lips she tilts her head like she's going to make out with you. I swear she does. It's so funny. She sneak attacks you. All right. I'm going to pick the next. I'm going to move that out of my way. And then pick the next card. Yeah, my one cat used to love to lick. Um, and she would, at night, I'd wake up in the middle of the night and half my head would be wet. And she would be licking my hair to clean it. Now, I had shorter hair at the time. But, yeah, she'd be licking it. I don't know whether she liked hairspray. Maybe that was it. Because, like, I would do my hair and I would, like, put some hairspray in it. And yeah, I'd wake up and half my head would be literally like wet because she would lick it for so long and I wouldn't even notice it until like halfway through I'd wake up and be like, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> but she was so weird. She cleaned me at night. That's what she did. She was cleaning the hairspray out of my head, I think. Add tissue or napkin. Um, 
Let me get some tissue or some. Oh, I have some right here that'll go here. I still have this from before, so I can use that on that one. And then. <sighs> All right, now I need to find the other tissue paper somewhere. Where's that tissue paper that I have? Some old stuff. I don't have it somewhere. Didn't I find it recently? Hmm. I could have sworn I found it recently somewhere. What did I do with it? Hmm. I don't know. Oh wait, what's this? Oh, I might have found it. Here we go. or tissue or something. There we go, using that. And um, Gracious, hard time finding anything in here. I have to tell Willow to quit licking. I'll be like, no lickies, no lickies. I call it lickies. Because, man, she'll just lick you to death. And I have to tell her to stop all the time. Because she'll just not stop. She was doing that to me earlier this morning. When I was trying to go back to sleep after I'd woken up. She just, she's re relentless with that damn tongue.
som man märker av. I hope I put the glue in the right place. No, no. Let's cooperate. Tissue and such. Gluing is very relaxing. Does anybody else find that to be the case? If I can get this thing to stop moving around, but I like gluing stuff. It's very nice and relaxing. Angela. Good for now. I gotta work on this one. Now I have one another napkin that I can find quick enough that was in the blue families. And they're both mermaid related. <laughs> but that's okay. I got that one and this one. Cut me a piece of this off. Hi, GG's Jump Journal Time. Uh, these are napkins here, but I have some tissue and then there's also we collage down paper as well So we did some paper and napkins and tissue If I can get this to cooperate and separate without having to Do anything funky which usually I can pretty easily and then we've got this piece here. Um, don't fall on the floor. Goodness gracious. Have you ever been here for our mixed media mashup, Gigi? Are you using Norpig? What? Say what? I got set two of the oxa. Oh, really? Awesome, Carla. 
You'll love them. They're fun to play with. You know, um, there's a thousand and a half videos, Carla. You can watch any one of the ones I've made and other people have made. There's tons and tons and tons. All you have to do is do what everybody you see has seen working with them before. Just do what they do. There's nothing really to it. Just squish them down on a mat and spurt a little water on it and then dip your paper in it. And that's the best way to get started playing with them. There's all kinds of things you could do. But that's the, that's the main thing that most people do, and it gives you some cool effects. And just play, that's all. You don't really have to know how, just play with them. You'll figure it out. That's what I try to, I try to stress to people that, you know, rather than having to do everything everybody else does with things, you know, and follow somebody else's rules or whatever, just do, do what you, you know, just play, just, just figure it out. That's the best way to learn. Just figure it out and play and don't worry about if you're doing it right or wrong. It don't matter. It's not, it's not wrong if you're having fun. I mean, it's not going to kill you to play with, you know, to play with, play with your supplies and, you know, not follow every rule that everybody has for it. I think I'm just going to do the mermaid. I'm going to kind of cut her out a little bit loosely and just put her on there, even though she's not going to really show and I'm not worried about whether she does or not. She might show a little bit towards the, you know, but... I'm really just doing a background, but, you know, whatever, whatever. I'll just stick her there. It don't matter. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> you don't have water, spit on it. <laughs> spit on it, pee on it, whatever makes it work, right? <laughs> if you don't have water. I would hope that you at least had water. Because <laughs> if you didn't have water and you were... But you had craft supplies and internet access, but you had no water, that might be a problem. You might have your priorities a little backwards if that's the case. Where's my can? I don't know where my can is right now.
Whoa, 87 degrees. Good lord, woman. You not have air conditioning, Miss Patty Ann? Hi, dyslexic blonde. You know, they make a, uh, a standalone air conditioner that you don't need to put in a window. It's not the cheapest thing in the world, but I know somebody who has one, so that's why I know they exist. So if you have a room with like either little windows that won't, you know, allow a window unit or whatever, you can get something like that. But man, that's all, that's hot to be sitting in. I could never do it. I can't sit. If it was, if it was more than like, I think... Like, I keep my house at 69 all, like, all year. But if it was hotter than, like, 73, 74, I wouldn't even be doing a live stream. I wouldn't be crafting because it would just be too hot for me. Um, I can't function in that. In when I, because I get hot. I, get, I start to get hot when it's, like, 72 degrees in here. I start to feel uncomfortable because my body temperature is just not... You know, I've never been one to deal with any kind of temperature above a certain amount. I just can't. My body gets hot so fast. Yeah, I'd melt into a puddle. I wouldn't be. I wouldn't even be in the house if it was 87 degrees. I'd go to a grocery store and hang out there or sit in my car with the air conditioning on. I have a window unit down in the garage in case of emergency. <laughs> you know, just in case my... I mean, in case my, uh, for whatever reason, the uh, air conditioning broke, which has happened, which really, really knock on wood because I don't need that happening this summer. It happened like, I don't think it was last summer, but like for two summers, it broke in a row. Um, I was like pissed. Um, I, I think, I don't think it was last summer. I think it was the summer before that, I believe. I know I was having heat issues. Was that last year? Well, yeah, because it was last year. Yeah, that's why I think it was last year. Um, I had the heat issues last winter. Not this past winter, but the one before. Um, and so that almost translated into air conditioning issues because they're both, you know, it's central heat and air. So when one thing is broken, neither of the things work. So, so yeah, so it kind of almost was my air conditioning because... I didn't get it fixed until right before the summer, like right before like the end of the spring, pretty much. I think it was, if I remember correctly, which I might be wrong, but I seem to remember it being fixed at some point around there. <laughs> I'd rather be cold than hot. I can't stand being hot. I'm okay with being cold. That don't bother me. I have a sweater. That's the thing. You can't, you know, once you, there's only so many layers you can take off before you're just like, okay, now what? You know, but when you're cold, as long as you're not, as long as it's not like below zero, if you're cold, you can always put a sweaters on and a blanket around you. You know, that'll, that'll alleviate the situation. But when you're hot, I mean, what am I going to do? Take my t-shirt off and then sit there and still be hot? You know, it's like nothing you can really do. All right. So are we ready for the next card? I'm sure some of you are over ready because I've been taking so long. 
Hi, Elizabeth. Well, thank you, Miss Elizabeth. All right. Put some paint or ink onto a piece of acetate and print, which we've done this before. If you don't know what it is, you'll see in a second. Um, it's kind of like a jelly plate in a way. So let's see, do I have a piece of acetate left over over here? Yeah, no, that's not it, is it? No, where's that piece I had? Dang it, I had a piece that I kept over here for that reason, and twice now I've lost it. Hmm, where'd you go, little sucker? You need to, ah, oh, there we go, I found it. So you can get acetate off your stamp sets. You know how they, they sit on a piece of acetate or a packaging, or I'm sure everybody has a piece of plastic. If you don't have this, use any kind of little thin plastic. And um, I'll start with this one here. And let me grab some other colors. thing. Hold on a minute. I'll be right back. Okay, see this is my stick. I call it my stick. <laughs> it's a massager. It gets knots. It, it hooks around your back and then you hold it from the front. This you can use for your neck or whatever. But when you're trying to get out like a knot that you have in your back that's causing you like spasms, you take this and you hook it around and then you, you hold it here and you put it on where the knots are and you just rub the knots away. Well, or whatever you do with them. And I had one on one side, and now I'm developing one on the other side, too, which has been bothering me. So, I don't know what the hell is going on. But, yeah, I just need to use it. Because every time I move my arms a certain way, it hurts. Maybe that'll help for a little while. But, oh. Good night, Cheryl. I'm going to be working on her, I, I haven't done, uh, um, yep, I haven't done Allie's card yet, but I'm going to be working on that, I have stuff picked out for it, I actually started working on it, and I was trying to cut something out of my Cricut for it, that ended up in a disaster, and I kept doing it over and over again, trying to get it to work, and it wouldn't work, so I'm just going to do something different, which is why it was taking me so long, because I thought for sure I'd be able to do it, and, and it would work, oh, what am I doing that for? but it didn't work, so, and I wasted like a couple hours trying to get this stupid thing to work, but it, for some reason, ugh, my cricket was just being completely ridiculous, and, well, I put way too much of that on, but, way too much, so, but I have a different game plan for that, so, I will be doing that instead. She might have left. She probably didn't even hear me. We're 
Uh, what? Oh, I thought you were talking me, t telling me that somebody had a recipe for something, and I'm like, a recipe for what? <laughs> You're talking about something I had a recipe for. I get it. What do I have a recipe for? What, what are you talking about? A gesso or a texture paste or one of those doohickeys? Okay, so I just put a bunch of paint on my acetate piece and then take it and put down marks, which now half my paint has dried, but that's okay because I could spray it and get it on my arm as well. Nice. Spray it a little bit and get some more off of there. Actually, I did, did pretty well. I got pretty much all of it off of there. And then you could just wipe it off and reuse it another time. None of us can type, are you kidding? I don't like, that's why I don't text very often because I suck at typing and I, especially on my phone, I'm just not, I just don't do it. I'll look at things on my phone, like, you know, if I'm in the bathroom or when I, you know, when I'm on the couch or something, I'll look at stuff on my phone, but I generally won't type a lot because It's annoying. <laughs> on a jelly plate? What's what on a jelly plate? Did you all see that? I'm giving mixed media tips. <laughs> Oh, that, that is a good tip. We did that in a class um, where we, was that a class, Janie, that we did with the jelly plate and I, I showed you the Ziploc bag trick? Um, but yeah, you could totally use a Ziploc bag. Good thinking, uh, Irina. I totally forgot about that. But yeah, if you don't have a piece of acetate, you can use, even you can even use a piece of saran wrap. You can use saran wrap. You can use a piece of a Ziploc. You can use anything plasticky. Um, that's kind of flexible so you could press on it. Like you wouldn't want to use something really hard because like if you used a, um, because your paper has like glued stuff on it and everything, using a piece of acetate or a piece of like something that can be pressed on and it's not going to be like hard. Like in other words, an acrylic block or something might be too, you wouldn't really transfer as much of the paint onto the paper as you might want to. Oh, I didn't see Barbara said goodnight. Goodnight, Barbara. Yeah, you could probably use aluminum foil just fine. Absolutely. Why not? Use, use aluminum foil. Wax paper. Wax paper, aluminum foil, saran wrap. Just fold over a piece of saran wrap a couple times so that it's not like super thin. It'll be a little easier to use. Make yourself like a little, it doesn't have to be perfectly square, but just make it like, like a little thicker. Use a couple pieces and kind of fold it over. Even if it's, even if it's wrinkly, it'll give a cool pattern, you know? Um, but yeah, you can use anything that's kind of, I mean, you probably could use a piece of paper if you're that, you know, if you really don't have anything, like a piece of copy paper would work. You just got to work quick so that the paint doesn't soak into the copy paper. Um, but I'm sure most people have some sort of wax paper, parchment paper, anything that'll be at least a slick surface so the paint doesn't, um, the paint doesn't seep into it and it you know, you can get a print off of it. All right, so let's see. Now I'm gonna grab some more blue colors. Maybe a little purple too.
a sandwich bag. <laughs> yeah, Ziploc sandwich bag, same thing. Same difference. It'll all work. It'll all work out. I'm going to use some white in this one. Oh, that's right. I fixed the, the lid on this paint thing. whatever whatever you got just all it has to be is non-porous so that the paint doesn't seep into it you know that would be the best thing to use is something that the paint can't really seep into so you don't waste your paint Good night, Elizabeth. Okay. I usually do make ATCs when I'm when I do mixed media mashup. I'll take it and cut it into ATCs and give them away with my uh, Zibit orders and stuff. So that's what I'll usually do with that one. Alright, does anybody need me to wait or can I move on to the next card?
yeah, if you have a question, it's best to put it in all caps because then I'll see it a little easier. I'm not a big fan of Nina paper. I, I don't like the cardstock. The 65 pound cardstock to me is too thin. Um, I, I think that the, the, um, I think the Georgia Pacific feels thicker to me. But I don't know. I, I'm not, I, I don't know. There's something about the Nina cardstock I don't like as much. I think it's better, from what I heard, it's better for like people that like to use markers and stuff. But when I tried to like, I tried to, I think it was, I, tr I was doing, I don't remember what I was doing. I think I was, I want to say I was using the Tim Holtz Oxide and I didn't really like the way it looked on the Nina paper um, compared to the Georgia Pacific. I don't know, I just like the Georgia Pacific better. It was 40 degrees yesterday, Angela. Now it's 80. <laughs> That's nuts. It's still wet on here. Maybe that. All right, we'll pick another card. Stencil. Stencil. Let's see. It might help if I... I'm able to do this without... My keyboard is like... I can't look while I'm typing because it's... I have to like to practically turn all the way around to type. Yeah, I, I yeah I, I like the Georgia Pacific. I, I just get it from Walmart. It's cheaper and it works fine, and I don't have any issues with it. You know. first and I need a sponge where are my sponges did I lose them did I go and lose my sponge where is it get another one. Maybe I left it in the bathroom. I'll be right back. Okay, I got a new one because I don't know where my other one is. I think it's in the bathroom. I think I didn't clean it. It needs to be cleaned. It's probably sitting in that jar. I have a jar in the bathroom that had water in it that I had a stencil, not a stencil, a, a brush and a 
and a sponge probably is sitting in there. Mary. Where have you been, Miss Mary? Your heap gun broke? Uh-oh. Well, you can still play along even if your heat gun breaks. Use a hair dryer. Just get one on Amazon, you'll have it in the next day or two, you know, easier than having to, than having to go somewhere to get one, you know. Let's put some of these on there. But for now, just use your hair dryer. Your hair dryer will do fine for just doing mixed media mashup, you know. We're already halfway through anyway. Yeah, just put the heat all the way on high and it'll dry, you know, as long as you're not doing anything super, you know, don't do, you know, like if we, if, if a texture paste one comes up, just don't just use, instead of texture paste, just use like some paint or maybe like stencil something instead and, and don't actually use texture paste. Um, because, you know, you don't want to use anything super thick because that'll take longer to dry, but I mean, you should be all right if you just use your hair dryer. Yeah, that's what I always used. I used a hair dryer for years. Obviously, a heat gun is better, you know, in the long, you know, for the long run. But I used to before they even had heat guns for crafting, like way back, like in the '90s and stuff. Well, I don't know if they had heat guns. They didn't. Any, I didn't have access to a craft store, so we had like a. We didn't really have a craft store. We had like a stationery store, and I would get stuff there, but. They didn't have heat guns, and I just used a hair dryer, and I would dry paint like that when I was crafting, or glue or something. I'd grab my hair dryer and do it. As long as you're not embossing, or you need like high heat. It'll do the job until you can get a get one on Amazon or something. Hi 
Laura. Did I say hi to you before? I think I said hi to you earlier, Laura. But I can't remember now. Oh, I need some stars. I got the big ones and I got my little ones. I almost never see these two stencils together. Because either I'm searching for my little stars and the only thing I can ever find is the big one. Or I'm searching for the big ones and all I ever find is the little ones. Which now I'm not finding even a little. Wait a minute, I just saw them. You have got to be kidding me. <laughs> You're like, something's crazy going on. What? I just saw them. Oh, there's a conspiracy going on in my house. Seriously, every time I have the one star stencil, I can always find this one, which is not the one I want, but my other one with the little, little stars. That one is missing again, and I just saw it two seconds ago. There it is. It was stuck to the back. See, I never have these two together. <laughs> I usually always find one or the other, but this time I want bigger stars. Actually, I have this stencil, which I need to put in my store yet. Where is the... Hello? How do I get it out of the package? It's stuck in here forever. Well, we're just going to cut it because I can't find the end to it for some reason. We'll do some of that one too. First we'll do that one and then we'll do stars. And let's see. I'm going to do a little green. Lime. Ow. I just banged my arm and it hurt. All right. Let's get it in there. Clean it off. You're using a gel paint thing in the middle, in between the MMM. What do you mean, like your jelly plate? Starting all over again. What do you mean you're starting all over again? Starting what all over again? stars in purple. Hi T. You went to the dentist, Janie? I think I asked that in the beginning, but then I started scrolling up through the things to say hi to everybody and I um forgot to see what you had said about that did you end up did they end up taking the thing off um the the cadaver thing
Oh, they, they said it's okay? Oh, good. Good, good, good. That's good news. Did that just happen from laying this down, or is that from before? I think that's from before. It's too dried on there. I don't know how I let that get all dirty. This one. Let's see. Maybe I'll do some water droplet things with. Um, we'll use some metallic paints. Oh yeah, I got that color too. I just grabbed some of these paints here. This, these aren't, um, these aren't metallic. These ones, I just couldn't. I don't know if I want to use that one. I forgot about this one. Yeah. The last stencil I used, which was the star one. No, that big star one is not. I have another star one. The little star one is, if it's still in stock. Um, this one is. These star, this star one is in my store. It should be anyway. This one I haven't gotten up in my store yet, but I will be in the next very soon. I just haven't had a chance, but... Um, but yeah, but you can go check out and see the ones that are there. I don't know which ones are still in stock. There's, you know, there's several. The checker one, I think I still have some checker ones in there. That's one of my favorites. Mm, metallic yellow. And then a metallic baby pink. I'll do some of those. Just throw some texture up here. Oh. Stay up there. And we'll see what we get. Money. Whoa. All right, we're gonna use. I want to use this one. I think. Start with that one, and maybe I'll add like this one along with it. Pink. 
gives you. Go down. And gonna have some checkers as well. Oh, my help! I cleaned off my sponge first. Gross! My water is disgusting already. Gross. Do you sell die cuts or a sidekick? No, I have die cut. I have dies, but I don't have die cuts or a sidekick machine or anything like that. But I have dies, and I'm about to add a whole bunch of stuff the second I have more time. But just go check out my store. Uh, maybe Janie can put up a link, and then you could just go see what I do have over there. Um, I got all kinds of stuff over there. Let's go give it a look, see, and see if there's anything that. Tickles your fancy. Whoa. Well, okay for that paint. Nice. I need, need a little help. Use just a little, uh, thick. <laughs> That's the word we're going to use for it, I guess. Pasty. Ugh, hands are disgusting. Can I just clean off my hands without adding paint to it? That would be great. That would be great. Thank you very much. All right, let's see if I can get some paint now. Just some paint, not the pasty substance that was coming out of it before. sell these sponges which are great for stenciling
yellow. Pink blob. <sighs> I had this stencil in my store, but it sold out. I have to get more of it. All right, we're gonna move on to the next, next card. Ink. I'm gonna add some ink. You can use um, ink pads or because I've ha I have a lot on here already. You can use, you know, just drip some ink or whatever. You can use your reinkers or your printer ink if you got some. Um, let's see, where's ink? Let's see. We got some inks. I'm gonna put some ink drops. Oh, is it, are we clogged? Why are we always clogged? I don't appreciate that. Do you gotta be clogged? 
Get pain in my ass. I need a pin. Thank you. Keep us squirting out your business. The acrylic ink has a tendency to get clogged up in the up in the squeezy thing. Because you gotta really shake the crap out of these. Shake, 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 Sonora, shake your body lot. Shake, 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 Sonora, shake it all the time. There we go. Now we should be able to do something. Huh. Not squirt it there, but okay. I could do that too. I'm gonna take some water to it anyway. Let it do some business. Get some of that shimmer on my page. around This one has any iridescence in it. Oh, there it goes. Never mind. A lot. have iridescence is it and I didn't know that it is it is what are you talking about May 26 that's that's Sunday is it not Sunday 
No, it's right. I don't know what you're talking about. It's May 26th. Uh, it's Sunday. This Sunday. Which is the 26th. What you talking about, Willis? Well, it's right. Oh, it says Monday on it? Does it? Does it say Monday? Oh, did I miss the thing on it? Oh, it does say Monday instead of Sunday. That's because it was left over from before and I just changed it and I forgot to change the Monday to a Sunday. Hold on, I'll fix it. Oh, yep. I did not change it. I'll do it now. Thanks for letting me know. I didn't see that part. Sunday. It's Sunday. Uh, whoops. S -N -N -D -A -Y. Sunday. Okay, the next time it comes up, it should be the it should be right. It's supposed to say Sunday the twenty sixth. Well, you were saying the date, and I was like, the date's fine, May 26th, and I didn't look at the day. <laughs> I didn't even pay attention to the day, but thanks for letting me know. I used the same one as last time where it said, you know, where it was Monday. I just changed to the date and I forgot to change the dumb day on it. Real smart. Okay, I'm going to do some on this one. We'll use some lime green. So what would I do without you guys? I wouldn't be able to know my ass from my elbow. If you guys weren't around to let me know when I'm putting the wrong date, time, and everything else.
Jamie. making weird little patterns or little roads <laughs> in the with the ink where it just goes in like loops around Was that one clogged too, kind of? Yeah. Kind of was. And it kind of unclogged too. Gross. Yeah, I got it all under my nails. That's going to be fun. I can never seem to get my nails not to have paint and ink underneath of them. Every time I do any kind of crafting. shake. Mm. Let's see, we're going to put a little bit over here maybe. Alright. Oh, I just dropped it on my lap. Nice. I could, you know, always used to be a little bluer. Always used to have a little more blue on me.
All right, let's move on to the next one. Oh, that's a pretty baby wipe. Next. Hi, Linda. Use white. Um, let me start with this one over here because this one is drier than that one. Use white. I think I can use um, We use this white, which is a pearl white that has like an interference in it. Has like you can't see, you can't see. Good night, Angela. It's kind of white, but let's see how it looks on here just makes some iridescent kind of I don't know if it shows up very much it does a little bit you can see the iridescence of it I wonder how it would look on here it makes like iridescent lines it is another color Pearl. I it had a different color. Yeah, this one has but this one has like a blue iridescent in it. That one had like a gold. Oh, uh, use white. Sorry, I didn't put it on the thing. Use white. So I'm using a white ink. So I'm trying to shake it up so stuff ain't stuck on the bottom. Maybe I need to help it along. Yeah, definitely need some help. Iridescent is like stuck to the bottom. After stencil came, add ink. Just look on the top of the screen. All right, now this one should work better. Yeah, it does. There we go. I can see more of that blue iridescent in there now. I wonder if you guys can see it. Kind of. Maybe. I don't know. like an interference ink it's got like a blue sparkle to it yeah you could see it because that's it right there and it looks blue and it's not but it looks it I wonder if I need to mix this one this one up more probably yeah this one's all stuck on the bottom too because they haven't been used in forever so that'll make it show up a little better once I get all that unattached from the bottom. Ew, it squirt on my hand. Stop squirting. Ew, I just squirted it on my face now. You're making messy. You're making me messy. 
I probably have it on my forehead somewhere on my hair. That's a look. Wait, what? Oh, did I not put the ink up? I thought I said, oh, I, I see. I looked at something different. You're right. I need to put the ink on the right one. I have it so small that I can almost not see it. Here, I'll put use white there and then use ink because it, otherwise it's in my way. So sometimes it's hard for me to see what I wrote already. Um, okay, that should be right now. Six is use ink. I, I looked up and saw ink. I don't know why, because I thought I didn't put it up. And then I looked up and it was use the, um, it was the other use ink. Um, you, what was it, ink pads or something like that? I don't remember. And so I thought I had already put it because I did that. See, now that one stands out a lot more now because I mixed up all the mica inside of it. It's got, it's like white with that yellow interference in it. Gold interference. Hi, Janet. Thanks. I'm just messing around. Messing around. That's what we're doing. I have another color. The blue. What's this one? It's a pink. This one's an iridescent with a pink in it. And this again will need to be stirred. Shaking it doesn't really kick it up enough. I need to kick first kick it up by using the palette knife to scrape it off the bottom and then shake it. And making a mess with it is always helpful. Hmm. All right. Now I should be able to shake it. Shake it good. Hi, Karen. Hi, Janet and Karen. <laughs> This one is more got a more pink hue to it than the the other one had like a yellow hue. This one has like a pink uh, iridescent. It's hard to see on camera, but one of them is more pink and the other one is more yellow. Got a little water to it. Maybe they'll flow a little better. If not, oh well. I like them like that. Anyway, that's the end of that. Ow. That's my, that's going to be my white. Even though it's not white white, it's a kind of an iridescent pearly white. But that's all right.
it takes so long to dry. Mm, but. Yeah, I know it does. It looks like this is an octopus, I know. Same like this one too, but this one looks more like an octopus. I thought the same thing. <laughs> That's just how I was bouncing the ink around when I was using that these inks. I was putting water on them and making them flow. Not just straight down, but around in kind of circles. Does anybody need me to wait? Or are we good? Man, they take forever to dry. Those inks. Yeah, I talked to her in a message the other day. I thought her last treatment was not last Thursday. I thought it was two weeks from now or three weeks from now. I think her last treatment is, isn't it? Or, or I mean, three weeks from her last treatment that she had. Because she still had one more to go, I believe. Um, but yeah, she her phone died. So I guess she's... Because I had tried to call her and it went straight to voicemail. And I was like, what the heck? But then she had told me, it was literally the next day that she said that her phone died. And I'm like, oh, that's why it went to voicemail. Next card. Add circles. Let me get my mouse to the right spot. All right, add cycles. Add cycles. Hard to do 
these circles with, with that one. But I like the big circles. Clump. Your birthday's tomorrow? Cool. You want me to sing you today or do you want me to do it Friday? Maybe I'll do this light color. Just let me know what day you'd rather me do it. Today or... Today or... Friday. All right, so I'll do it today. I'll do it now. I'll do it right now. Everybody needs to help me sing along or help sing along and sing happy birthday to Miss um to Miss Karen who's turning 92 <laughs> tomorrow. <laughs> She's going to smack me for that. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Karen. Kieran, I don't say your name right, I know. 
Happy birthday to you. You look good for 92. <laughs> Happy birthday, Karen. Fifty-seven. Who's fifty-seven? You're fifty-seven. You ain't fifty-seven. <laughs> How old are you? You're not fifty-seven. You would settle for 57. <laughs> now on this one I wanted to do little my my little circle stencil because I need it. but oh, there well don't want that one either I realize I have a ton of circle stencils apparently apparently there's one in particular I was looking for but I don't know if I'm going to find it oh wait is that it no that ain't it either I'm going to make circles with the stencil That'll work. I'll use this one. I think that's the smallest circles I have. No, I have these. I have to do these then. I'll do this one. Oh really? I didn't know. I didn't know you were fifty-seven. You were turning fifty-seven. I thought you were. I thought you were like my age. You, well, you don't look like you're fifty-seven. That's for damn sure. <laughs> You're not going to have no more birthdays? 
Well, whether you celebrate them or not, I hate to tell you, but they're going to come anyway. I just wanted some small circles instead of actually doing other kind of circles. I'm going to do these circles if they show up, which yes, they do. Just enough. Just enough. Excuse you. I'm not 42, I wish. Add four years to that, and that would be me. Add a few years to that. don't see I see four centuries 400 years who's that me <laughs> this is, Janie made Janie made me 400 years old hey if I'm 400 years old and that means I must have been doing something right. <clears throat> but I don't think I'm even going to go near that number in my life. I highly doubt it. I don't think I'd want to. Well, if you're looking at any of the pictures on my Facebook, the, the my current profile picture was taken two years ago, so I don't look that good anymore. The last time I actually felt like I looked okay and didn't look my age was like when I was around 40, 42, that was about it. And then it all went downhill very quickly after that. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. Next card. Number nine, use household stamps. Household stamps. That would mean these suckers. Maybe some bubble wrap. Of course. I'm not going to not use bubble wrap. I always use bubble wrap. Mm, let's see. On here. this color in because excuse you to make a nasty noise 
always at me. Berry, excuse you. Berry, it is very nice. Uh. No, you don't have to do it again if you don't want to. You can. You don't. You have another household stamp you can use, maybe, or I mean, you could skip it if you already did things that were similar. You know, and you don't want to add any more. I can add a, this is like a purpley color. I can add a little bit to this one too. Just a little. It's kind of a purpley color. Just very lightly tap it here and there. I, 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 excuse you. I didn't ask for the back of it to get done. Thank you very much. That's not what I was going for here. There we go. Just a, a couple of light circles over there instead of letting it go to waste. All right. How about I take some um, where'd the white go? There it is. You know what? I'm going to use gesso for this, so I'm going to use this. Whoa. Don't fall down. I'm going to use the big bubble wrap, which I haven't done in a while. I'm just going to put a few spots, but I'm going to use gesso. Oh, I forgot that's not, not dry yet. <laughs> the, dang it, the berry isn't dry yet. That's what happens. Oh, <laughs> bye, Karen. It sounds like her battery did the same thing mine did a while ago when it decided to just die. 
Kind of mix a little water in with that to kind of thin it out just a little. Water there, and then do this one the same. Get on there, it's going everywhere but the canvas. <laughs> I got it all over the desk, but not the canvas. I did get it on the canvas, but not the last couple. Good aiming. Smooth move. Are we ready for number 10? We don't care if you talk too much. It doesn't matter, Janet. You can type or you can use the Use the voice to text thing. Oh, are you guys together? Is she at your house or are you at her house, Janet? Or are you in your own homes? You're having your yard sale Friday and Saturday? Cool. I hope it does good. All right, let's pick the next one. Make marks with a crinkled paper. paper mark. Oh, I hope I closed the gesso so it doesn't dry out. That would be smart. think I'm gonna do to both of these actually instead of using paint I'm gonna use some glue and then I'm gonna put some glitter on it with my glitter thinger where is my glitter thinger at 
But I'll put the, I'll put the marks with the glue so it's like kind of random. Oh, that's an awful sound. There it is. I found it. There's my glitter thinger. So what I'll do is take some of this glue. Actually, I'm going to use the thicker glue so that it stays in place a little better because the Mod Podge would be uh, would likely dry quicker. I'll use Aileen's. It'll be a bit thicker. Good night, Carrie Ann. Yeah, quite a bit thicker. Come on, thicky. Actually, maybe I'll use some of this and I'll put some of that Elmer's glue in too because I have it sitting here and this will probably come out a little bit easier. Yeah, there we go. There we go. And then I can kind of mix the two together. And then I'm going to take it and dip my paper in and go like that, 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 like that and that. And then I'm going to take glitter, which this one's going to be a bit much over on that side, but that's all right. Move that out of the way, and I'm going to, I'm all going to glitter it. I'm not going to use a ton of glitter. I'm just going to put it down and let it fall into the areas where it's got the some of the glue. I'll take, take that off there. There we go. I got some glitter. Look at that. Yay. Me a lucky. Now I made a mess with the glitter. I should have probably caught it into something. And put it back in the bottle. Here, I'll put this over here. Ooh, I'm getting glitter everywhere. some on here too. And the nice thing is you can just throw away the paper when you're done and it's not really anything to clean up other than your glue. I'm trying to put it back in there. Oh, covered in glitter too. Nice. So if you're done with yours and you're not going to, you know, worry about the optional ones, you can go ahead and start posting your pictures up. 
but I'm going to draw the optionals now. Let's draw them out. First one is going to be texture paste. The next one is use black. And the third one is add words or a quote. So those are the three optionals. Number 11 is, you don't have to do these, but obviously you can pick and choose which ones you want to use or use them all. It's up to you or use none. So once you're, you can either take your picture now and then finish your last three after you do that, or if you think you can get the, the ones, your optionals done quickly, you can do those now and then take your picture after that. get the uh, I'm not going to do the optionals but I'm going to get the uh, the cup from last week and pick a uh, and get everybody's name from anybody I missed still that put theirs up last week between last week and today and uh, write their names down while you guys are finishing up do that and then do all the things and all the things. All right, let's see. Oh, my keyboard. Whoops. Make sure when you put your picture up, you put MMM number sign 105. I got hers last week. I already had her. Am I losing my mind? I know I, yeah, here it is right here. Okay, I already got hers. I don't know why it doesn't have a heart next to it. I was going to say, I remember hers. Either she posted it again twice or I just didn't, the heart didn't stick when I put the heart next to that one. Um... Same with yours, Kathy. I know I have yours from last week. How come yours doesn't have a heart next to it? Because I remember I commented on your flat. I know for sure I got yours. Did the hearts I put on last week not stick? Ugh. Freaking YouTube, man. Yeah, this one too. What's going on? Ugh. Dang it. Oh man, is this going to start being an issue because because I know I have these people in here. Like every one of them that I'm picking that I'm going through now doesn't have the heart on it. from last week. So I have to double check all of them, which really sucks. 
I don't know what happened. Freaking annoying. Yeah, here's Kathy's right here. I'm not seeing Jacqueline's for some reason. Did she win last week? Is that why I don't see it? Yeah, okay, she won, so she won't be in this one. But I did heart hers. It's like all the ones I hearted just decided to just not be hearted anymore. Erin, there's yours right there. And it's not, it's saying I don't have a heart next to it. Oh, I know why. I know why. Stupid freaking Facebook changed the way. Okay, I know exactly why. Because all of a sudden, right, every time I log in, every time I go to the group now, anytime I post anything, if you've ever noticed, it says Pink Poodle Crafts instead of my name. That's why. Because it's not showing up under Pink Poodle Crafts. As if Pink Poodle Crafts has a separate screen name. It's not. It's my group, but it's not my screen name, which is really confusing. So all of them are going to show up again as if I didn't. So I'm going to have to double check them for this week. And hopefully from here on out, it won't do that. But that's freaking annoying. That's really freaking annoying. Because it's still showing. Yeah, even... Oh, man. Is there a way to change that? Because that's going to be really annoying. There's got to be a way to make it so that I don't... Because it's still not showing up. Even... It's still not showing that I hearted them. Like, I can't explain it any other way. Let me show you. All right, so when I search, right, I go through here and I look because if I hearted it, and that means if I already seen it, it'll say you, Y-O-U, at the end right here where it has the little symbols. It'll say you, and then it'll say names and 15 others reacted to it. So it'll say Y-O-U on all of them. And that's what I look for. Well, the ones that don't say Y-O-U, and it usually has somebody else's name first, those are the ones I didn't heart under my name, which is why I'm getting confused because this is the easiest way for me to look through and find the ones. See, because none of these are saying you at the beginning, meaning me. Um, that I reacted to them. So I'm gonna, I have to see if there's a setting to change that because otherwise it's going to do that every single week and I'm going to have to sit here every week and go like, no. It was so easy when I didn't have to do that. Um, let's see. There's got to be a way. Settings. Name. Okay, contact. Da, da, da. Is there a way? Identity. No. Name. Your Facebook information. Um, public posts, maybe? Public posts. No. <sighs> this is going to be so annoying. Why do they keep changing things instead of like, I mean, it's just stupid. It's just stupid. Like, stop changing stupid things that are not necessary to change. And if it's not necessary, then it should be an option rather than just, oh, all of a sudden now this is happening. You know what I mean? Because now I'm going to have to go through a hell of a lot of trouble to get everybody's thing now, and it's going to take me forever. And I ain't got forever to sit there and do that. Like, I don't know how to fix this. Edit group settings. Let me see if there's something anywhere. Oh, here we go. Group name. Well, that's the name. Linked pages. Okay. Where Facebook is like the most annoying thing. Edit linked pages, maybe. Let me try unlinking that page and see if that does anything. Let's see if that makes a difference. Hmm. 
Maybe it's picking up my name from... Okay, good, good, good. All right, I think it did it now. All right, I think what happened was it linked my Pink Poodles page and it was making me be Pink Poodle Crafts every time. Okay, good, I fixed it. Oh, that was gonna piss me off royally. Okay, so now they all should be right. Because, like, it's such an easy way for me to find everybody and to know that I... Yeah, see, now, now it says... Here, I'll show you. Now it'll say... What it's supposed to say it says you because i already excuse you i already commented so i look for that and if like right here it doesn't say you first meaning me these two are ones from later you know what i mean it has to say you and then i know i already hearted it so that's what i look for and so it makes it 10 times easier for me and quicker to write everything down that i need to do all right so Oh, what am I looking for? Get out of here. Oh. Because then I can just click on those particular ones, put a heart next to it, and then write it down, and it's done. Without, that's why. It linked my stupid page, and then was making me, like, apparently, every time I commented or posted, it was saying I was pink poodle crafts instead of me and I really don't want that okay um, I'm glad that I was able to figure that out quickly enough because that was annoying oh I got you already oh wait this is your Oh yeah, never mind. Miss Michaela played with us last week. Well, she didn't play with us, I guess. She played you guys played it afterwards, I guess. Did I heart it? Yeah. Okay. Now I have to keep moving all you guys' things because for some reason it it doesn't it keeps popping up it keeps popping up all the uh stop it makes me click on it i'm i gotta find a way to stop that from happening where they pop up on the left side of the screen saying that, you know, the different notifications. I can't stand notifications that pop up on the screen. Nothing drives me more mad than stuff like that. I can't stand it. If I want them to pop up, then I should have the option. It shouldn't be forced upon me that I have to have things popping up in front of me. it drives me batty to have stuff like that happen so it sets off my ADD and just makes me like where I can't focus on anything else on the screen because that keeps popping up you know I don't I just don't like that I'm not a fan not a fun. Well. Okay, I got them all. I got some, I got some, I got some, I got some. She messaged it to me? Okay. That for tonight, you mean? I'm assuming you mean for tonight? Yeah, I haven't gotten that far yet. Let me get these taken care of and then I will get it. But thank you for letting me know. I appreciate it. You're trying to get rid of the notifications? <laughs> Are you getting notifications too? Yeah, I can't stand them. People shouldn't be forced to have to be notified about things. <laughs> All right. 
I got these guys from last week. Crossed out. Okay. These are last weeks. Okay, well, I'll check that in a second. Message and then Laura's is in an email. I gotta remember Laura's is in an email. And are you in our group, Doji? All right, this is for last week. Um, for the ones who did it during the week. So if you did it during the week and then turned it in, well, that's what I have here in front of me. I need a drink. My mouth is dry. All right, so we will get them. We will get them. You have to go to bed early. Uh-oh. Oh, she's having her elementary school graduation. Awesome. All right. I got the wiener from last week. Miss Colleen Gravis. Gravers? Gravers? Gravis. Colleen. She was new to our thing, so that's awesome. A new, a new person won. So, Miss Colleen... R A V I R, I think it is. I'll find her. I will get in touch with her because I don't think she's here today. I don't like this pen. I need a different one. That would be a pain in my buttocks. Where's the one that I, the one I like to use? I'll just use this one. I'll use this one. Okay, I'm going to start looking for the ones from today. Yeah, I don't think Colleen is here today. I didn't see her here. I know she was here, obviously, last week. Or was she? Yeah, she was here last week. Like during the actual live stream. Okay, um... Let me start looking. First, let me go to my messages and get dojis. Um, you must have sent it to my, now doji, do you, are you in our group? Uh, why won't this come up? Hello, there it is. Uh, did you answer me? Did she answer me when I asked her why she's not, is she not in our group? Oh, she must have left. Okay, I'm looking and I think she left. Okay, I will find it because I think she sent it to me in Pink Poodle Crafts, my Facebook page. Um, so, let me look. Where is that damn spray bottle? I'm always losing things when I need them. Okay, never mind. Mm. There's a gnat in here that's driving me nuts. And I'm just trying to find my one spray bottle so I can spray the crap out of it. I guess I can't. I don't know where it went now. I tried everything to get rid of these gnats and it's just not happening. I don't understand. Don't understand. Okay. I am not seeing it in my Facebook anywhere. Do you know where she said she messaged me? She is in our group, but not on Facebook. Huh? Well, in order to be in our group, she has to be on Facebook. I don't know where she messaged me this her thing because I'm not seeing it unless she did it in my email as well, which is possible because, you know, 
some people say message instead of email, so I get it. Anyway, let's see, because I don't see it on Facebook Messenger. I don't see it on my page. Um, oh, wait, is this it? I see an email from her. Nope, it's not that, though. We were talking about something else, because I know she had emailed me about something. Um, hmm. Hmm. I, I don't know where she messaged me. What the hell? Um. I don't have a message from her. Oh, wait a minute. Message request. I didn't think to look there. There it is. Isn't that her, isn't it? Yep. Okay. Never mind. Found it. Duh. I forgot she would. I keep thinking everybody's on my Facebook just automatically. <laughs> okay. So I will show her those. Let me put that screen up. There we go. There's her. She did very good. Beautiful. Very pretty. Okay. Now Donna Jenkins. Okay. So then we will have that one. I'm assuming Laura's has not gotten to me yet. an email um i'm not seeing it yet let me look again not yet okay well i will start looking in the group for now until and i'll check in a little bit okay one person wants to join the group. Um, no. All right. Just stop it. All right. I'm, I'll do that after. I need to do this now. All right. Bobby. Very pretty, Bobby. Beautiful. Very beautiful. Oh, that's 104. I already did that. Oh, see, now they're all going to pop up because I... <laughs> sat there and liked half of them. We gotta look for the ones that are 105. <laughs> Day. Ooh, pretty. Very pretty, Miss Amy. Beautiful. Miss Angela, very pretty. Beautiful. Everybody's looks like springtime. Ooh, very cool. Mary did a great job. That looks so cool. Awesome. Very cool. Beautiful. Oh, very cool, Tina. That looks awesome. Miss Tina. Beautiful, beautiful. And Miss Teresa. Ooh, yours is yours looks like uh it would shine under a black light. I love it. Very pretty. And Miss Jacqueline, very pretty. Ooh, Irina is very pretty. Very pretty, Miss Irina. Beautiful. That's going to make a beautiful tag. 
And Miss Laura Free. Yours is really pretty too. Beautiful. Looks very metallic y. Looks like Metallica. Ooh, Kathy's is very metallic y too. I love it. That looks really cool. Miss Kathy did good. Beautiful. That's really pretty. I like the landscape in the background. And Miss Deborah. Ooh, yours is gorgeous. I love those colors. I like the blue with the red really pops and the yellow. Gorgeous. Sweet dream. Gorgeous. Ooh, be my. I love it. Gorgeous. Is that an ATC or a tag? What? what? No, I didn't do that. I was trying to hard it. Stop acting up. Beautiful. I better put a heart on that or I'll forget next week. Love it. I love it. I love that envelope, Janie. I seen that last night, or I don't remember when it was. I was looking on my phone, and I thought it was really pretty. Ooh, Miss Mildred. Very pretty. Very pretty. Gorgeous, flowery. Very springy and pretty. Ooh, JB's is very pretty, too. I love seeing everybody's interpretation of the prompts you know it's interesting how everybody's is different it's very cool Ooh, miss judy very pretty very cool Ooh, yours is nice and bright miss susan not wasted paint book oh is it both or together are they the same? Oh, I see. So you used, you didn't, I get it. You didn't, these are, this is the paint that you didn't waste when you were doing that. I gotcha. That makes sense now. <laughs> Let's see. Very pretty, very pretty. Let's see, come on heart. Miss Patty Ann. Ooh, yours is really springy too. Very pretty. Gorgeous flowers. Ooh, yours looks cool, Tiffany. I love it. Beautiful, beautiful. Ooh, Miss Donna. She's got hearts and stuff on hers. Very pretty. Ooh, Miss Cheryl. Very pretty. Love that. That's a great background. Ooh, pretty, pretty, pretty. Very pretty, pretty, pretty. It almost looks like the background is like lattice or something. And I think we're probably at the end. <laughs> Ooh, that's cool. And this is the one I got. Okay, I got that one already. Who did that? <gasps> Ooh. That reminds me of those plaster things I made. Susan, they look cool. All right, let's refresh. I try not to get off on a tangent on other things because then I'll forget it. We'll be here all night. We got Miss Laura's. We got Miss Tina. We got Miss Bobby's. And we got Miss Amy's. And we got that one. We got that one. We got Miss Jacqueline's. And we got Miss Kathy's and Deborah's and Bima's and Mary's 
and that's not one, but we got Miss Mildred, and we got JD, and we got Judy, and we got Susan, and we got Patty Ann, and we got Tiffany, and we got Donna, and we got Cheryl, and we got Kathleen, and there's no new ones? We got them all in one shot? That can't be possible. That can't be possible. Can't be possible. We got every one of them in one shot. Maybe it's because I took so long with the other thing I was trying to do. Could be. Yeah, it looks like it. All right, so if you don't have yours up, make sure you speak and say something in the chat because, ouch. Amy's is posting hers? Okay, so I'll write her name down and I'll go, Amy. And then I'll go look at hers in a second. Anybody else? Hi, Deborah. I've been good. How are you? <coughs> what about you, Esther? <clears throat> Did you do yours, Esther? You did your first ever glue page and it took you six hours? How big was this page? Was it just like a collage page, basically? Is that... I, don't, I never know what a glue page is. Is that basically a collage page? What's the difference between a glue page and a collage page? I'm trying to figure that out. Oh, she needs to be accepted into the group. You're not in the group? I thought you were already in the group. Oh, let me get you in there. I don't see anything. Janie, did you already accept her? Because I don't see any new invite things. No? Oh, there it is. Oh, it disappeared. Okay, stop it. There it is. He, they, they always like move around. It's like Facebook. If, you, if you're not done loading, then don't show me anything. Uh, see, it's gone. Miss Janie probably got it. She jumps on it. She's fast. She's speedy. All right. Amy, you're not in the group? Is it Was it Amy that's not in the group? She's done it before, hasn't she? You glued a napkin to paper? Just a single napkin? It took you six... Wait, what? Wait a minute. You glued a napkin. You said a napkin to paper, and you're saying it took six hours? Oh, okay, your email came through. All right, let me go look. Do, 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 do. Oh, there it is. There it be. Ooh, you did a lot of things. What's going on there? Holy moly, did you do a lot of little stuff today or something? Or is that like past ones that you've done? Whatever it is, it looks yummy. Oh, okay, I get it. So that's the one you did today. And then I get it. I got you written down. Very pretty. That's gorgeous. It looks like all, like, I see you have, like, the lace there and there, but that all looks like lace, too. Like, what you, the pearly kind of color. I don't know. What is that pearly color? Is that just, like, pearl, um, um, the stuff? Is that that pearl? You know what I mean? I can't speak. The pearl stuff that I have. Because that one looks really, really nice. Yes, a napkin and two images. You lack confidence? Why do you lack confidence? What's to be confident about? It's just a piece of paper. You should never lack confidence. Just go with it. I mean, what's the worst that's going to happen? I'm sure you have another napkin and another piece of paper. Hi, Mary Jane. Amy. Oh, was I thinking of the wrong Amy? I wrote down the different Amy. I'm thinking of the wrong Amy. That's why. Okay. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. All right, let me look. I was thinking the wrong Amy. I wrote down the different Amy, so I'll have to cross her last name off and put yours in. Uh, what happened? 
Where am I at? Oh, I'm on the wrong page. Doi. Okay. Did you get your picture up yet, Miss Amy? I don't see it yet. Oh, I got you, Esther. Got you. That makes sense. You fell asleep, Shannon? <laughs> you need some sleep. Sounds like you needed some sleep. Or maybe we maybe we bored you to death. What if the queen sees it? Who's the queen? Do you have a queen? There's a queen where you live? Bye, Deborah. These damn gnats are driving me nuts. Get freaking thing die already Fima took all yours took all your what tell her to give it back no I'm not I'm definitely not no queen I'm more like a the queen dumbass Amy, did you get yours posted yet? Which one of you is the Amy that's trying to post their thing? I'm going to start cutting these up because collage give me something to do. Well, I should do it this way because that way works better for me. Excess off over there. There's names on that. I almost threw it away. Doi. I was like, that's excess. We don't need it. We'll need that piece. And that piece. We don't want to throw away names. We just throw away the excess pieces. We don't need the excess. Oh, it is you. Oh, okay. You're having a hard time putting out my picture. Can you just email it to me or send it to me in a Facebook message? Email me at pinkpoodlecrafts at gmail.com or just put it in a Facebook message to me. I don't know if that'll work any better. I didn't know it was that you were the Amy because I, I didn't see you in here. And so I was like, which Amy is it? I thought you were already in the group. Oh, 
Okay, she can email it. That's all good. Maybe an internet issue or something. Internet sucks. That's all good. Well, she doesn't have to do that. If she's emailing me, she doesn't have to put tag me or anything, obviously. I don't think you could, could tag me. Whoa, in an email, get back here. Let's straighten you out. You're crooked and it's driving me nuts. It doesn't need to be crooked. Where's Teresa today? Teresa didn't do it today? Are you not here, Teresa? Her and Vern didn't do it today? I just realized that. Maybe they were busy. Had something going on. I'll write down Miss Amy on this piece here. It did? Oh. Thank you. Thank you. I guess when I was moving everything around, i straighten that back out. All right. I already put Amy's name in there. I got it. It's in here. There it is. I see Miss Amy's. Are you not done with it yet, Miss Amy? What? Where'd it go? Ugh, oh, what did I just do? Oh, okay. For a second, I thought I just clicked out of the thing. I love that doily. Where'd you get that doily at? It don't look like a... It don't look... The heart doilies that I have are ugly. I'm trying to find my screen. There it is. I was like, where'd it go? What? Nope. There. There's Miss A Miss Amy's. But I don't see any of the prompts that we did tonight. <laughs> where are they at on there? Miss Amy? It's good to do art so you can be happy. Of course it's good to do art so you can be happy. It's very much therapy. <laughs> oh, that's a smart one. I got one of them. I killed them. I killed them. I killed them. <laughs> They're in there. Okay. <laughs> I just killed it. All right. Well, it's really pretty, Miss Amy. I can't wait to see what you do with it further. Maybe make a, I'm assuming you're going to make more out of it because it looks really good. It looks pretty. All right. I killed, I killed one of the freaking nets. There's a big one. There's a big fat one that's been, I don't know how it's fat because, ooh, one of them landed in my water bucket too. Good, die, bastard. All right, ladies. Are we ready? to try before I started crafting. All right, anyway. All right. Miss Susan, Miss Susan. Matt 
murderer. <laughs> Miss Susan, you win. Is she still here? Are you still here, Miss Susan? Miss Susan. Congratulations, Miss Susan. You get you get this. You will get this. And I'm going to leave it like this, and then you can finish it and do what you want with it. So it's a background already started. You could choose to do what you want with it. You can continue it. I'm going to wipe any excess glitter off of that now that it's dry. Make sure that there's none going to fly off of it. Now that the glue is all dry, anything that was not tightly on there. There we go. Is she still here, Miss Susan? Anyway, she gets the she gets the canvas. Okay, and this one is for uh All right, awesome. Congratulations, Miss Susan. I don't think she's here though. I'm gonna write her name on the back of it. Um, anyway, I'll write her name on the back and stick it over here. All right, so thank you for playing. I had fun. I appreciate you being here. Um, I'm going to do another live stream. I'm going to stop this one. And then I'm going to restart a new live stream. To do some other crafty stuff. I just have to clean up this mess because now it's a disaster in here. So it'll, I'll do it in like about 20 minutes or so. So I will, I will talk to you then. Don't forget anybody that is in the Patreon that is gonna, is, is in the class tomorrow. Um, the class will be at 6 p.m. Uh, hopefully anybody that ordered their kit, they should have that. Probably would have had it yesterday maybe, but at the latest you should have had it today, which I'm assuming, I don't know. I haven't heard anybody say anything, so. Um, that they didn't get it. So, but anyway, I will see you guys shortly. I'll talk to you in a little bit. Poodle Pack out. Pink Poodle Crafts, join the Poodle Pack. It's time to get creative and make you laugh. Make your own or today. Pink Poodle Crafts is the way. What a good boy.